Yeah, so it's only going to be a short video and I thought while we was out on our walk we'd take this opportunity to thank everybody for the lovely messages uh, about Rosie. We was absolutely overwhelmed with that and uh, couldn't believe the amount of response we got and such kind words from everybody. So thank you for that. So we're in the town of Stoke Ferry, which is uh, not far from Thetford in Norfolk. It's absolutely beautiful here. We've uh, done a video from this site before. Um, it's called Grange Farm. And uh, it's a lovely setting by the river. And Kirsty's just over there giving the dogs a rest because uh, we've been on this walk. And today, it's turned out really hot and sunny. <laughs> Well, we're back down the river again, as you can see in the background there. We, uh, we arrived and the weather was absolutely atrocious and we couldn't do any filming whatsoever. Couldn't even go outside the van. It was that bad, as you saw on the clips there. Um, we're just uh, taking the dogs out now on the day that we're going home. <laughs> yeah, we was only staying for the one night this weekend.
so uh, the dogs are really really tired so we've had to stop underneath a kind of a bus shelter area and uh, let them have a rest are you tired are you tired are you tired yeah I think they want to get back to the van as, uh, as quick as what we do Grange Farm the one we're staying at now is mainly seasonal pitches um, they've got about four or five uh, touring pitches there so um, you don't really see too many tourers on there uh, we've got friends on there that we that we see which is why we we go there quite a bit we enjoy it there down by the river so I think we're gonna head back to the head back to the site now we're in the village which is about a 20 minute walk away so we're gonna just uh, walk back to the site now and start packing up <laughs> but first a visit to the shop for some biscuits or a lovely cup of tea. We're just approaching the site now and um, this is out the back. Don't know if you remember from the last video, I didn't uh, film it from this angle but there's a little fishing lake here and that's where people live on the uh, narrow boats but uh, yeah we're, we're trying to hurry up at the moment because uh, we're a little bit late back from the walk we'll try and get back and ask the uh, lady if we can stay a bit longer or offer to pay to stay a little bit longer if nobody wants to get on our pitch um, but that remains to be seen We're back so I'm just gonna go and ask um, ask the owner if I can uh, if we can stay on a little bit longer hopefully if we can we'll leave about three o'clock it's about 11 now usually departure time but uh, can only try Right, there's no one in. What should we do? There's no one answering. <laughs> no one answering the door. So the car's not there. Oh. Don't know what to do. Don't like to just assume these things, you know? So what do you think? I mean, there's four other pitches free. We've only got one van there. There's a pitch here, a pitch near, and a pitch behind the van. We do normally stay on. Yeah, but I just don't like to do it without saying. Or asking at least, you know? Um, Thank you. 